Yo, how's it going, everybody? We're doing a master clue guide. Um, so I'm gonna do a little bit of what's in my inventory and a little bit of showing you how to do clue steps. Um, but what you need, you need a complete Broken Home, Cabin Fever, Curse of Zaros Mini Quest, Death to Dorgishkan, Hunt for Surak, Impressing the Locals, Within the Light, One Piercing Note, uh, Recipe for Disaster, Branches of Darkmire, Fremenic Isles, Jack of Spades, One of a Kind, Unlock Cyclosis Within Player Own Ports, um, the, the quest to get Blade of Dive, I mean Dive Ability Succession quest, Double Surge is really helpful. Max Cape would really help to add Dungeoneering Cape, Slayer Cape, the Quest Cape, or the Cooking Cape, and Acronia Stand to put the Crafting Cape in, Archaeology to get the Abyssal Link Relic to have no runes required to teleport, 112 Archaeology, Shadows Grace, level 67 Archaeology, Persistent Rage, level 98 Archaeology. So for the compass clue, you know, you teleport to the island that once were turtles. If you are using the new alt one, it'll automatically make the line for you. But you want to use the island that once were turtle as like a center point. So you want to do the mini quests the, uh, for the arc journals to have. Um, and and uh, put the teleport tabs in your arc journal. The only reason I have the island that once were turtles outside is so I don't accidentally put in pocket and remove my big book that's active um, but you don't need to you can also replace that with anything in your skilling preset uh, into your main preset or add another power burst of acceleration um, but yeah so alt one automatically makes a line for you now but if you if you turn that off you can turn it off if it if it messes up too too much you can un uncheck the track minimap to solve clues and so look, if I uncheck that, I clear the marker, I have to zoom, so you have to zoom in. So for master clues, you zoom in, you double click where the the little red marker is, and you click the coordinate clue and it makes a line for you. And that's the only place you teleport to the art journal. I mean, to the, at the start, you teleport to the island that wants for turtles, and then make the line for you. So we know this is in Goshima, we go to Goshima. Depending on how much points you have, Philip Cerulean is in a different place. You want to try to get to 400 quest points so you can have Philip Cerulean in in uh, what's it called the fight caves. You have to find like even if you have 400 quest points and Philip Cerulean is not there in fight caves, you have to go to each place. So pre quest, you know he's he's uh, right in Ardy. Second, he's over here by the outpost, um, west of Artie, 100 points, he's over here by the Brimhaven, I mean the Fremnik dungeon, 150, he's over here by uh, Shiloh village, 200 quest points, he's over here in Ecto, uh, Fat, Port Phasmatis. Uh, third, where is this place? I have no idea. Oh, zero seven. Oh, he's in the Ganodermic, Ganodermic place. Ganodermic creatures. Three hundred. He's in Dorgish Khan. Three hundred and fifty. He is in Piscator's Hunter area. And four hundred quest points. He is at Fight Caves, which are, which is where you want. And you know, you just teleport. Fight caves. You can't be in combat when you're teleporting to, to uh, with the Tokozo, so just make sure of that. Um, and so we got a we got a skilling preset, or we got a skilling step. So you open your your bank, load the next preset, click it, boom, you know, it's done. Next we have a heart teleport. Okay, so look, we go to we go to the heart right away so it's double thinking um to check the hellware area over there you want to go to the first ring uh line of this bridge you know um and this will check all the hell hellware area and if it's not there we go toward um vindicta so you want to blade dive surge down 
and cross this this line, this threshold. This is the line. And that'll check over there at the very corner by Vindicta. And if it's not here, we teleport towards retreat. And you want to like surge blade dive into Twin Furies portal. And it's here. If it wasn't here, if it was like a single ping, we would teleport straight out. And um, check Greg Gregorovic. But if it was a double ping, we would kind of go down and power burst uh, upwards that way. Uh, north northeast, we would power burst from twins to northeast, and it was probably on that platform over there. Um, okay, so we got a Dark Mire. Let me tell you about Dark Mire. So, Dark Mire, we teleport. It's double pinging. It's single ping right away. So that is going to be all the way down there. If you have... If it double pings and turns to single ping, you kind of want to use it here. Jacket preferably. So we got another heart teleport. Okay, let's go to the heart. Go to the heart real quick. So again, we go here. First part of the bridge, it'll check Hellware. No? Cool, we go the other way. We go towards Hell... Uh, Vindicta. And it started triple pinging. Boom. It is right here. Cool. If it wasn't, it was still. If it was single ping or double ping, we go straight. Like after we cross that line, we go straight to uh, Twin Furies. Remoki Skin Weaver, you want a jacket. Or if you have a Ganondermic mask, you, you can only teleport to the Remoki Skin Weaver twice with the Mask of Ganodermic, so... The Wise Old Man, Archaeology 901. Archaeology teleport tab, I mean, uh... Scroll. Teleports you right there, or you could use the uh, Amulet of Glory. For Compass Clue, we teleport straight to the island that once were turtles, right? And it'll automatically draw the line for you. We're getting lucky, we're getting Goshima right away, so that's great. To get access to the ninth glider that uh, is on Twilight, you get a clue step that's really close to this. So you need to do castaways. It you have to find you have to find somebody on. Okay, so castaways are non-player characters that can be found in the arc by finding a message in the bottle and using a treasure map contained in the bottle to locate the castaway. Azalea Oakheart. So. These cast if you just type in wiki castaways, it, there's a bunch of them. You need it for Master Quest Cape. Um, but if you're just doing Master Clues, this is pretty pretty nice to have. So and it and it only appears the message in the bottle only appears every so often, so you have to check. So this was visible one day ago. Um, so it'll be visible again in six days, so kinda sucks that you have to wait, it's time gated, but um, it is nice to have. So once we have this teleport, right? We teleport to Alka Rid. If, the, if you have a clue step there, right? Like a compass clue that t uh, tells you you have to go there. You go to Alka Rid. If you step on this exact spot right here, even though we're facing north, it's gonna push us northwest when we surge. And then you want to like blade a dive and click captain the captain right here. Click Kai Unduri. I mean you know nine, the no, ninth gnome glider, and the clue step will be right here. So you can just instantly meerkat scroll. If you're using an ECB necklace, you want to ECB right away. Surge. Call target cycle. Ricochet and and uh, use the bow spec right that's what i do death is a very easy clue you know you go to wars you teleport you go to death's office and you want to try to blade a dive right onto the spot right right away and then click on him so there's it saves a little bit of time all right we got a brother tranquility quest you if you have the amulet of nature and you Go to Harm- oh, so you use the Big Book of Piracy to go to Harmony Island and plant a flytrap seed in this patch. You don't need to have it diseased before, you needed to have it diseased. Not anymore. You would just 
um, once it grows, you can attune the amulet of nature to this this spot. What I do, as soon as I get in, I'm clicking one east, one east of me, and surging, and two sp squares away from the water barrel. I'm s click uh, blade diving and surging, and then clicking the door to get in instantly. And then brother tranquility is right here. And then, you know, if you do that fast enough, it's super quick clue step. All right, so a perfidinus clue step. You always go to Traherne. I have it instantly triple pinging right there. So if it's over there, you want to click on it, surge, and then there's a you bladed dive over here. Like uh, you want to bla bladed dive to these this line right here, and you can also like after you bladed dive, you want to instantly click over it this way. So let's let's do this let's do this step again. Alright, we got another Heart of Gilinor. Let's go over here to the bridge. Check Hellware. Nothing over there. We go to, straight to Vindy. Blade dive, surge down, cross this threshold, this little line. Uh, there's nothing on this. It's still double pinging, so we go straight towards retreat. Surge, blade dive, straight into the Twin Furies. Make sure you have um, your Reaper portal either as a Twin Furies, Greg, or Siru. So you want Siru, Twin Furies, and Greg portal, right? Uh, so anyways, yeah, we go into that one. It's double pinging. We go this way. Sweet. It um, looks like we're going to have the power burst, and it's probably over there. Yep, there it is. It's double pinging already. You want a bladed dive, like, basically right onto... Uh, Lady Traherne, and it's triple pinging, so we know where it is, which is south. Teleport to the island. Actually, you should move a little bit just in case it's it's on the island that wants for turtles if it's facing downwards. Um, we go straight to Cyclosis, cool. And the clues are here, cool. Pog, pog. Oh, Alley the Wise, okay, look. So we use a Desert Amulet 3 or 2 to teleport to Narda. If you're far, if you're on this, these two squares, this one and this one, you can surge Bladed Dive into the area and, you know, into the house basically and then talk to Ali right away. Death Altar, uh, Tyrannian Quiver has 5 teleports for free. To the death altar. I think I think you need three or Tyrannian Quiver three, but you might need four. I'm not hundred percent sure on that. But uh, yeah, make sure you use those before you use your Wicked Hood teleports. Of course. Smell to Bane Bar. You wanna spell book swap to Lunars and Belated Dive toward the furnace. And uh, well you need to have an inventory space. To do this of course you create it and deposit it right away lady Traherne. of course we go straight to use a tune crystal teleport seed straight to lady Traherne. and you want to kind of blade dive right next to her and click on her as you're landing on the tile harvest the radiant memory if i have four out of four jacket uh or backpack i skip the harvest the memory because it takes space a Globetrotter, I mean, Remoki Skin Weaver, you kind of got to use a jacket if you don't have any more Ganodermic Mask teleports. Island that wants for turtles. So for Island, you always use the Arc Journal straight to Port Serum. Click on Quartermaster, go to the Island. It's triple pinging already, sweet. <laughs> if not, you would go to this, this little uh, door on the ground and then straight to the island, uh, the, the portal, the turtle portal. But yeah, let's go. Okay, we got another heart scan. All right, teleport in. And it's triple ping. <laughs> I'm getting lucky, bro. Uh, but anyways, yeah, bladed dive surge. 
down those steps. You don't want to take the long way down. Siphon of Blood Rest, Esrath. Yep. You know, don't want to do that. That takes a long time. Island that once were turtles, we teleport. I mean, the compass glue, we teleport to island that once were turtles. You see how this one is all the way over here on this side of Cyclosis? You want to jacket this right away. It takes so long to go all the way down and around to get to this spot. So that that's a jacket. That's a for sure jacket. This spot. Unless you don't have one, then you're gonna have to like walk all the way around, but um, yeah. Twilight, you know, you just use your arc journal Twilight. You can blade a dive through this wall, so make sure you try to do that. Save some time. Remember, ECB right away, soul split ECB, call Yuri, target cycle, Griko, and into the bow spec. And it should be dead. Click on quartermaster, go to the island. Surge, go to the door. If it's not, if it doesn't double ping, then it's this way. Go this way. Make sure you st click this way because the character wants to go north, but you around that bush, but you want to go south because it's gonna it, it's a longer path that way. And there it is, cool. Malignus Mortifier. Okay, look, nine five to lows on the archaeology teleport you want to step like right here if you if you can disassemble disassemble and surge bladed dive and click on malignus mortifier um i and then you click you know do the lockbox skipping ticket and give it back to him right away so where i stood disassemble surge bladed dive and if you do, you do that fast it's saves so much time for this clue step, that uh, we have to go to Waiko, we want to power burst it always if we can, if it's if it's not on cooldown, because it takes a while to get there, and you know, one, this is a uh, you know fast <laughs> cluing. <laughs> Teleport to the island that once were turtles for a compass clue. It makes the line for you automatically. We know that's in Temple of Amanishi. Sweet. So for Temple of Amanishi, so say it was pointed northeast, like it's point. It was pointed downwards, but then when you teleport here, it's pointed northeast. You want to go towards retreat and go to Sirus. If it was pointed northwest, it's on this on the northwest side of the isle island. So you want to go like this way. And it's probably oh it's up there for sure um okay again let's try amulet nature one step east surge you want to dive to two steps away from the barrel and then surge click on the door to get in and then you're in you click on brother tranquility and you're done right if you do that fast enough it's uh it's great Drake of the Medallion, you want to go to Darkmire right away, of course. It's double pinging, so you go go in. Let's, let's cross this first torch, let's see if it's still double pinging. It's triple pinging, sweet. So we know where it is. Alright, we got a Prif scan. We want to go straight to Traherne right away. And as soon as you step off, you want to go to Lady Traherne, go this way, surge. It's still single pinging. We want to go straight to Amlod. And it's still single pinging. From here, you want to go straight to Criers. If it was double pinging, I'd go to Myler. But it's still single pinging, so we go to straight to Criers. And there it is. You get familiar with where Suf is in Prif, and it'll become your favorite scan. Island that once were turtles for a compass clue, straight away. It makes a line for you, right? And we don't know if this is Whale's Maw or Twilight, so I always go straight to Twilight first. And we know now it's on Twilight. Again, Amulet of Nature one step east. 
one step east, surge, bladed dive, surge, and click on the door to get in. And you're in, cool. Narda, Ali the Wise, Narda. As soon as you get in, you want to click here. This, these two steps, right here and here, right? So, as long as long as you're in the line, you want to surge, blade dive into the into the house, right? And you're in. You can talk to Ali the Wise. For this bow or curtsy step, I use passage of this traveler's necklace to the outpost because I don't have a quest cape in my max cape. I have the dungeonarian cape, the slayer cape. Oh, I do have the quest point cape. But anyways, I usually put the cooking cape in my backpack and then I have the crafting cape on my anachronia stand, which you should definitely put. So cooking per cape, you don't burn food. Crafting cape, you can make the dragon leather, black dragon body without needing thread. Um, but anyways, yeah, so this step, you ECB straight away, you can bladed dive, surge this way, and you know, or surge bladed dive this way, and you know, right away, start the double agent. Okay, so for our wet arm, I'm a third. I use a trinawin tr tr no, tr quiver, bro, I don't know how to say this. Uh, click one to teleport to Ledia, and he's right next to you, so. Uh, skilling, I always go to War's Retreat and Bladed Dive straight to the bank. Click my preset to load it, the skilling preset, and boom, done. Back to back, Brother Tranquility, cool, 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 cool. Alright, so, one thing about clues uh, is building a good preset that you like. You can go on cluechasers.gg slash... Uh, uh, discord.gg slash clue chasers they have tons of information lots of clues lots of help if you uh, have any questions you can also ask me on my discord i'll link it down below um also stream on twitch if you guys don't know twitch.tv slash zingsta um making a preset is uh what's gonna help you the most i put my pre my preset is a little different from the clue chasers discord preset and honestly, as long as you have similar items in any order, it will help you a lot. You can move stuff around. I've been playing and toying with this and that. Oh, what if I have this item in, in my main preset and not in my skilling preset? And uh, I have a couple of redundant stuff on my skilling preset just in case um, I want to, you know, use that skilling preset to go do Heart of Gilinor or go do the the compass clue which doesn't require pvm right any anything that doesn't require pvm i could use the skilling preset but uh, of course we want to use your main preset for most of it just in case you get a yuri uh pvm preset i mean pvm clue step right um hope this helps if you have any more questions again ask in my discord or in cluechasers.gg slash Discord.gg slash clues chasers. Um, everybody's really nice and yeah.